What is going on, fellas? Whoa, ouch, that hurt. Okay, today I wanted to do an actual challenge video today. It's a double jig challenge, but I wanna see if I can catch two crappie on one line at the same time. So first I'm gonna walk you through how I'm tying the double jig set up on, and then we're gonna go find the brush piles that I'm thinking they're gonna be on. If they're not on the brush piles, we'll find some deeper weed lines we can kinda troll or jig. But I'm hoping they're on brush piles so I can vertically, vertically jig them. All right, let me show you how I'm tying them. Let me show you how I'm, I'm going to tie these jigs on, and then I'll show you the actual rod setup. It's a three-inch swim bait. That's going to be on the bottom jig, and on the top jig, I'm going to go with. I'm going to go with this actually, completely different. I'm going to go with the pink and chartreuse. Pink and chartreuse top jig. So there we go. And of course, I want to top it off with some, some slap sauce. This is actually G-Sauce, but uh, I might throw slap sauce on. I haven't decided yet. You always got to top off these, uh, these tubes and plastic swim baits. Got to have some scent on them. Gives you that little extra edge. All right, let's get on the water. Let's try to catch two fish on one line. That's the goal tonight. It's not about number of fish. It's just about two fish on one line at the same exact time. That's the goal. All right, here we go. Spot number one. Well, first let's uh, spray these guys up with some, some good old sauce. Let's spray this guy up first. It's an older bottle. Looks like it's leaking out a little bit. Let's see if we can find something. Looks like I'm right on the edge. <sighs> 15 feet of water. Some deeper weeds right, right below the boat and it's like it's a, the weed break. Oh, there he is. There he is. Jeez, that's a giant bluegill. Holy smokes. It's a tank. I'm gonna grab the, uh, wow, he's probably, I mean, that's probably a solid, ah, oh, screw it. It's probably a solid eight and a half, nine inch bluegill right there. Well, there he goes. Oh, there he is. Got him that time. Oh, that's a crappie. Yes, oh, it's a good, wow, that is a really good crappie. Holy smokes. For this lake, that's a pretty dang good crappie right there. I'm gonna get the board out. Easy. All right, tail, tail pinched, 11 and a quarter. That is a, uh, that's a good crappie. Darn good crappie. Actually, I'll let him go. But the goal was to catch two of these on at once, one time. I'm gonna let him go. We'll get back down there. Should have thrown a buoy out, dang. All right, new battery. Just threw that 11 inch crappie back. Let's see if we can get two of those guys at the same time. They, they're they liking the pink. You know what? Since both those, the, uh, the big bluegill and the big crappie like the pink, I'm just gonna go pink. I think that's gonna give me the best odds for catching two crappie on one line at the same exact time here. All right, here we go. I don't think I move much. It's very, very calm out tonight. 
he was in deeper water. I'm only in 14. I think that, that fish was like in 17. I think. Oh, that might have been a hit. Oh, there he is. There's one. Should really tighten. Oh, that. I don't know if that's a crappie. That's because it's a pike. No. God, I hate those things. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. Come on, get out of there. All right, get off my boat. There's one. Uh, I wonder if it's a school of small bass. Well, that's not gonna work, bud. Jeez. Oh, we did drift. I just looked at the shoreline, we did drift. Oh, here we go. There he is. Well, every time I troll, they hit the bottom jig. Every time. He's a little eight and a half inch fish. Oh, there he is. Well, there they are. Just really throw a buoy out. What is this guy? Uh, he's just shy of 10. Just shy of 10. There they were. There he is. It's a decent one. I might, I might measure 10. Maybe. Nine and three quarters. Nine and three quarters. There's a fish. There's just, there's hundreds of them down there, but they're all eight, nine inches. Still fun to catch though. There we go. All right, this is day two, continuation of that double jig. Double jig challenge, trying to catch two crappie at the same time on one line. And uh, this is probably a better lake for it. Not, not for big fish, but uh, for schooled up crappie. They're in real tight schools on this lake for some reason already. They're overbrushed, well, they're just on the outside edges of brush piles. They're in deeper water too. And when I say deeper, I mean they're in easily 20 plus feet of water right now so we are gonna try to uh, just juice these up with some slab sauce try to get this done kind of slept in was up late editing a bunch of videos last night for all you guys and uh, yeah was planning on getting out here about 5 30 6 a.m. got out here about 9 30 so I think I'll see the school okay they're right in front of me here Maybe not that far out in front of me. Let's see if we can get two crappie going here. Yeah, there's a big school right below the boat. Oh, better tighten that drag up. I had to retie from last time, so I only got, the, the jigs are actually about two feet apart, which I'm probably, it's probably a little much for trying to catch two crappie on one line, but I think it might be possible. There he is. 
Uh, it's only on one though. There it is. Two of them, one line. Done. Two crappie on one line. Challenge done. Took a while, but the, uh, the pink and chartreuse Pico scent rings got it done today. Challenge complete. <laughs>